So I want to thank those from the St. Andrews Priory for being here, and Dr. Ruth Fletcher is the, she's the big boss, headmaster of, of the place, that they you step up, because it starts, edu it's about educating that next generation. And sometimes the younger generation actually educates the older generation. We learn sometimes through our children. So I want to thank the children who are here, and the young adults who are here. Acting with it as people, and having the land interact with the ocean in a natural way. And I'm, I think this exhibit is much about that. You know, I want to thank our federal partners with NOAA, a great organization. We gotta, we gotta, guys, we gotta fight for NOAA. We have people in Washington, D.C. that doesn't think it's so relevant anymore. Those are the same people who don't believe that our climate is changing. But ask the guys in Kauai who just saw 50 inches of rain in 24 hours whether that's a common occurrence. Or the nine inches we got out in Hawaii not long ago. So NOAA is there fighting a good cause and we need to support them on the federal level. And then provide at least a little something. So let's give them a round of applause. And for the final acknowledgement, a very, 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 very big mahalo to Aaron Thurston, Russ Morcami, Alex Otto, Chef. So I created this piece last year, and um, it was kind of a stressful time in the school year, and so uh, the portfolio students had to create a new piece, and I thought um, that I'd like to create something a little more peaceful, and I wanted to try a realistic uh, painting style, so I found some pictures of Koi to get some inspiration and then I ended up choosing one photo and trying to, uh, trying to copy it a little bit but then add my own style and then it kind of turned into a painting of its own. It didn't look like the photo anymore and um, I found it was very stress relieving because um, especially the water because it, uh, it sways a lot and it's very flowy so I enjoyed doing some really delicate uh, wispy brush strokes so that was really fun to do and also doing painting the koi fish especially the detailed features I find that um, painting detailed realistic pieces are my favorite type I like detailed work so I really enjoyed that climate change is a, a hot topic and I think that this exhibit definitely sheds light on that um, there's some people in our nation's government that don't really recognize climate change. And I think that by uh, bringing, shedding light on climate change through art, which is something that people enjoy, makes them happy, will um, make that problem more clear to people in a happier way. I think exhibits like these that showcase the beauty and the magnificence of the ocean are really important to show to our community because when we're, we're around the ocean so much these days, we're either going surfing, we're going to the beach, and we notice all the trash, but we never do anything about it because it just seems normal. But when we have showcases like these where they shows like the true beauty of the ocean and the creatures inside it, we can see what we, there is to protect and how much um, we should protect the creatures living inside of it. We're so excited that our girls are able to participate in this exhibition of art. It's art about the ocean. We want them to love the ocean. We want them to know all about it because we are going to be faced with climate change in our future and the policies that we build will be based on the next generation of people and we want them to be well educated so our children and our children's children will always have beautiful natural environments to uh, be exposed to. Science is wonderful, we know a lot about science however art really appeals to people's emotions and they love uh, beauty 
and the natural world is beautiful. And so we want our children to love nature. And if they love nature, they will want to preserve it so that future generations will always have it available to them. I think exhibits like these that showcase the beauty and the magnificence of the ocean are really important to show to our community because when we're, we're around the ocean so much these days, we're either going surfing, we're going to the beach, and we notice all the trash, but we never do anything about it because it just seems normal. But when we have showcases like these where they shows like the true beauty of the ocean and the creatures inside it, we can see what we, there is to protect and how much um, we should protect the creatures living inside of it.